Every team in the league is trying to do the same thing, and you gotta give. It sucks right now. We won. We I and mean, we are in the overtime. We have one goal. We're game seven at home. You know, it's it's not like we were that far away, but it, you gotta give Montreal a lot of credit too. Hell of a hockey team. Works really hard. Sticks with their structure, and uh, they have a lot of great players. And uh, everyone underestimates them, which. You know, it's um, good for them, you know, but it's obviously sucks for us. It just came down to they did a better job scoring goals than we did in the series. Chances were there, but it seemed like every time they got an opportunity or a breakaway, it ended up in the back of the net, and we weren't able to do the same on our end. Um, you know, there's, there's no need to, to point fingers. Um, like Marty said, this is probably the, the best team that we're ever going to play on. So. Um, as players, we just have to be better, and um, I think we we expect that from each and every one of us. I mean, I got skunked this series. Um, that can't happen. Um, you know, I'm the captain of this team, the leader of this team. Um, take a lot of responsibility for what just uh, just occurred, but uh, if I can, I guess, take anything, I'll have to. See what went wrong over the summer. Um, you know, this team's been through a lot of adversity uh, in four seasons. Um, been to the Cup final. I've been to two conference finals. Um, you know, we've had a lot of different heartbreaks. So um, I'm excited to um, learn from um, mistakes. And, and try and uh, build this team to uh, a Stanley Cup winner, not just a contender. From a year ago when we got to this point, uh, I thought we were better. We were better during the regular season. We were better during the playoffs uh, uh, against two really tough teams in Minnesota and Colorado, but we still we still uh, fell off at the wrong time. So, you know, there's another door we've got to find a way to barge through at this time of year. And um, I think everybody's got to look in the mirror, obviously coaches included.